Welcome back everyone to our channel. This one is going to be short and sweet and about upgrading your outdoor uh, speakers. This is a 2014 KZ303. That means the speakers are seven years old and they're crackling and making weird sounds. So it's time to upgrade them. All the ones I've seen on videos, they're cutting holes into the side of the RV and flush mounting it and spraying foam and all kinds of stuff. I don't want to do all that. Keep it simple, 10 minutes max. Step one, you want to take off your old speakers, okay? I went to AutoZone, made by Boss, 225 watt peak power, that's plenty. And these are four inch speakers, not four and a halves. And this is why I had to get four inch. When you take off your speaker, these are four and a half inch. So if you had a four inch and a half inch speaker that fit flushed, that would be perfect, but their old speaker was four inch and it sits inside. So I found a four inch speaker again at AutoZone. And what I did was take us my snips and I snipped off all the little tabs all the way around. I apologize, it's right here. I saved one for you. So you wanna snip all those off, okay? Make sure you put these in as the old ones came out. There's a little hole on the bottom to drain any kind of condensation. So I'm putting it right back as the old one came out. Push it in there nice and flush. And take my one tool to install. After you take it out of the box, make sure you reuse your cardboard, lean it up against the RV so you don't scratch it up. All right, we're on top of the ladder. All speakers are gonna come with some, part, some sort of speaker wire. So go ahead and just cut a piece off that you think you need, strip it off, and then strip off the old one uh, that comes out of the RV. Really simple, twist them together. Now the one in the RV is a thicker gauge wire than the one you're gonna get at AutoZone or any, any uh, parts store. So always wrap the thinner wire around the thicker one and bend it back over uh, the RV wire so it's a little thicker. Get some electrical tape. Make sure you tape it up real good. Nice and tight. Just shove it back in the hole. Be careful not to pinch the wires, not to have them touch each other so they short out. Make sure they're taped up pretty good. All right, we can tuck that around the side there. That goes to the bottom. All right, get your screws. a drill. Line it up with the hole right there, you see it? Bam! Alright guys, after you tighten up all the screws, get yourself some clear RTV silicone. This is a old one that I have, so I apologize. I have to take it out the back side. But go ahead and just uh, carefully Silicone it all the way around to stop any kind of water all the way around. And then you're good to go. Like I said, 10 minute speaker upgrade. Clear so it doesn't show on whatever color your, uh, your rig is. That's just it, you tighten up the screws, silicone it to avoid moisture, and you're all done. When you come on down from the ladder, make sure you use your teeth, <laughs> safety first. Turn the gloves inside out, and that's it. Time to party. Let's see if it works.